New tonight, shocking video out of Sun City shows a caretaker allegedly hitting an elderly woman with dementia. We do want to warn you that the video you're going to see is disturbing. The incident captured on camera in the woman's apartment at an assisted living facility. Team 12's Colleen Sakura is outside the facility where the family says the woman was hit. Colleen. The video appears to show a caretaker hitting a woman multiple times on the head. That woman's granddaughter saying it left her grandmother with bruises on her face. We do want to warn you, some viewers may find this video disturbing to watch. I immediately wanted to cry. I was so shocked. Like, how can this even happen? It's something Tracy Ripley never thought she'd see. Her grandmother, Lurleen, appearing to be hit by one of her caretakers. You are the one responsible for caring for her. That's how you treat her. I just, it makes me sick. At 96 years old, Lurleen has dementia. Ripley's family placed her and her husband at the Woodmark at Sun City, an assisted living facility back in January. January. We're not able to care for her in our homes because, she, you know, she requires a lot more care than any of us are able to give. Adding a camera to keep tabs on what was happening when family wasn't there. And after Lurleen's husband died in March, the camera added extra security. I was glad we had the camera so we could at least just kind of see her and know she was safe and taken care of. On Friday, Ripley says the camera caught her grandmother asking the caretaker to put her footrest down. Okay, go down. She was unable to do that for herself and they were not listening to her. Which agitated Lurleen. She poured her, or threw her water on the caregiver and then threw the cup off to the side and the caregiver hit grandma on the way to picking up the cup and then with the cup as she was leaving the room. Ooh, the strikes leaving bruises near Lurleen's left eye. With grandma and the dementia, she reminds me a lot of a toddler. And I have a toddler and that's exactly what she, you know, he acts like that. She acts like that. You don't retaliate, you don't hit them. The Wood Market Sun City would not comment on the incident. Ripley says they fired the caretaker, but her family wants to see more done. We feel like this caregiver that just came so naturally to her that it does worry us and we'd like to see her spend some time in jail. The Maricopa County Sheriff's Office tells us they are investigating this case and say charges will be filed with the county attorney's office. In Sun City, Colleen Sakura, 12 News.